Do you ever find yourself questioning the real cost of wealth? We all spend most of our lives working for financial security, often sacrificing time, relationships, and even our health along the way. But here's the question. Is financial wealth really the ultimate prize? Or are we overlooking other, more valuable forms of wealth in our pursuit of a paycheck? What is wealth? There are many types of wealth, and each has its own unique benefits. Financial wealth is just one piece of the puzzle. The truth is, real wealth is multidimensional, and once you understand these different types, you can start building a more fulfilling life. Time wealth. What is more valuable, being a dollar billionaire or a time billionaire? Let's be honest. Would you want to trade places with Warren Buffett right now? Sure, he's one of the richest people in the world, but at 94 years old, at the time of this video, even his billions can't buy more time. This is where the concept of time wealth comes into play. Time wealth is irreplaceable. It's the foundation upon which all other wealth is built. You can always earn more money, but you can't earn more time. Once it's spent, it's gone forever. Think about it. A million seconds is about 11 days, but a billion seconds? That's about 31 years. If you're in your 20s, you probably have more than 2 billion seconds left to live. But are you treating time with the respect it deserves? Time, unlike money, doesn't come with refunds or do-overs. Physical and mental wealth. How often do you think about your health as a form of wealth? Physical and mental health are two of the most overlooked forms of wealth, yet they're critical. Confucius said it best, a healthy man wants a thousand things, a sick man only wants one. Physical wealth is your body's resistance to time. If you don't actively maintain it through exercise, good nutrition and a balanced lifestyle, you could lose it, just like money. But physical wealth is nothing without mental wealth. You could be in peak physical condition, but if you're mentally plagued by anxiety, stress, or a lack of purpose, you won't enjoy the benefits. Health wealth is personal. It can't be transferred, sold, or gifted. Relationship wealth. Now think about your relationships. How much do they contribute to your overall happiness? If you have all the money in the world but no one to share it with, how meaningful would that wealth be? The National Institute on Aging has even equated the health risks of prolonged loneliness to smoking 15 cigarettes a day. You don't need 100 friends to be wealthy in relationships. In fact, research suggests that just three close friends can have the same emotional impact as $150,000 in additional income. But relationships, unlike financial wealth, require time and effort. They can't be bought. Skills Wealth Skills are one of the most convertible forms of wealth. They are also one of the few that directly contribute to financial wealth. Skills give you the ability to earn, create, and innovate. In fact, in many cases, being wealthy in skills is a precursor to being wealthy in money. But not all skills are created equal. The rarity of your skills and their demand in the market determine how much they can convert into financial wealth. There are over a million artists on Spotify, but fewer than 0.8% of them earn more than a million dollars in royalties. Skills take time to develop, and there are no shortcuts. Financial wealth. Now, we arrive at the form of wealth that society values the most, financial wealth. Money is powerful because it's the most convertible and transferable form of wealth. It can buy you almost anything, material goods, experiences, even some forms of healthcare or leisure time. And unlike time, health, or relationships, financial wealth is easily measured. But here's the twist. Financial wealth is only as valuable as the other forms of wealth you can convert it into. Without time to enjoy it, health to sustain it, or relationships to share it with, financial wealth can feel hollow. So. Ask yourself, what form of wealth are you truly working toward and are you spending it wisely? If this resonated with you, 
Take a moment to like this video, share it with someone who might need to hear it, and subscribe to the channel for more insights. And as always, thanks for watching.